Hi, this is Priyanka Chopra and you're watching Miss Manami Doctor. You're a guest girl. How does it feel? You're up there with like likes of Perez Hilton and you know like all these hot like models. You know, Claudia Schiffer. Yes. Good choice. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know. I'm having a difficult day today. Okay, so tell me a little bit about the looks. You had so much fun. First of all, you shot with Brian Adams. What was your reaction when they're like, so your photographer is going to be Brian Adams? I thought that it would be another guy with the name Brian Adams. Who would have thought that, you know, the, the singer Brian Adams would actually be pictures? It's bizarre to think that somebody can be so multi talented and so good in doing, you know, professional photographer. It's not like just a hobby. So that was really great. And plus, I mean, I saw some of the other campaigns he'd done, and and he's a really cool guy, you know. And we met, and we hung out, and he knows so much about India, and he loves India, and so it was really great. That's awesome. Okay, so we got a lot of tweets in, so I picked a couple of questions for you. Number that wants to know: What is your favorite guest product or something to wear? Blue jeans. Blue jeans. Any day, guest jeans fit you like they carved out. They really do. At least to me. They look like it too. Size. <laughs> and what was the best part of doing the campaign? Um, to be associated with a brand which was so iconic, um, Guess has always been associated with the most beautiful women in the world and you know 30 years of the most iconic brand and whenever you see the campaigns you know, they're not the camp kind of campaigns that you forget. So to be a part of that legacy for me was um, coolest. That's awesome. And did you get to sing any songs with Brian Adams? Like did you guys goof around and sing together? We did. I was trying to get him to sing Desi songs and he only made me play Bollywood music while while we were doing the shoot and I was very happy to do it. What songs was, did he like? What Bollywood songs? I'm sure he liked like yours exotic, not Bollywood. Well, that pop, is hard. Yeah. yeah. But uh, I was playing more Hindi music. You know, the stuff that had come out. So I was playing like Patmiz Dil, and I was playing like <laughs> Boom awesome. ke gaane, You know, like Punjabi songs. Yeah. And, so I was playing all of these latest songs. That's awesome. So those were from Imam and Sush. They'll kill me if I don't mention their names. Thank you, Imam uh, and Sush. And any plans to launch your own clothing line and perfume? Like Ritik Roshan has just done HRX and you're obviously, you fit, as you said, sample size. Do you think there's going to be a PC line sometime? Could be. I mean, I've never really thought about it. Right now, I have the best brand in the world doing it for me. So um, um, it's not really something I've thought of, but I don't think too much anyway. When it comes to my work, I just do. So if I do it, don't be surprised. And if I don't, still don't be surprised. <laughs> So Nazia, you never know, she'll keep you guessing. <laughs> and which celebrity fashionista style do you look up to? I mean, you're a style icon yourself, but do you have any? And um, that's from Priya. I don't have a particular person that I look up to, but I like people who can carry themselves with confidence. You know, I like people who don't really care about how they should dress. And, and different women present themselves like that different times. So I can't say this one particular person, but I imbibe like various people's styles. And today is your amazing manager Natasha's birthday. Yeah. So, and you have you celebrated so far? What are your plans? And do you have like a message she for her? No, we have a surprise party for her. But we're gonna maintain like nothing's happening. Just another do? average another working day. At day. Work. I'm trying to make it boring, but there's a party. <laughs> and a message for the guest girls. Who's? How do you keep the guys guessing? Well, the best way to keep a guy guessing is never ever reveal everything about yourself. Most of us, being emotional fools that we are as women, end up telling guys everything. But you know, you have to keep their intrigue, which doesn't mean lie to them, of course, never lie in a relationship. But keep them intrigued, keep them guessing. And a message for your Miss Malini fans? Well, I would like to say that all the Miss Malini fans have been so kind to me always. Stop being rude in your, you know, the comment boxes. I don't know why people are so mean. Losers. Um, <laughs> it is, it's just a cry for attention, but I would just like to support everyone who is, you know, so supportive of me always and, and to you yourself, Miss Malini. Um, thanks, it, it feels great sometimes to, you know, have people who have your back and you always have